Hey, it's Katrina here, and I wanted to talk to you today about eat, play, love, not eat, pray, love, although that's good too, but eat, play, love. What am I talking about? I'm talking about your business. I'm talking about your marketing. I'm talking about making it more fun, making it more around um, being open and present to opportunities, clients, uh, wealth, money, uh, and opportunities, right? So I'm actually headed out to Dallas today to go to the eWomen Network Conference um, that's this week. And I'm super excited. It's the beginning of conference season, right? And conference season is back. Yay. So then in October, I'm going to like three more events and November, another one. So this one kicks it off and what am I going to do when I go to conference? Well, yes, I do a little bit of networking and work in the room and, you know, seeing if there's anybody that might be interested in my business coaching or the publishing services, of course. However, but where I find my best connections, especially when I'm going into a space like this, is to be love, is when I go in and I'm, and I just be love, be open, be present be interested and curious with whoever I come ac run across, uh, be inquisitive, be caring, thoughtful, giving, and uh, insightful, inspiring, that kind of thing. So being loved to me means more of a being rather than a doing. Whereas, um, so I, this morning I had a little session with my friend Pamela Moss. And so she helped me get wrangle this um this being back into light because a lot of times I get caught up and maybe you do too uh with the doing in our businesses the big you know here is my to-do list right luckily there's a whole bunch of stuff crossed off and luckily nothing else on here has to get done before I leave so yay I can go play now so I can go be love I can play with friends and new connections and uh, and of course eat, <laughs> that's where the eat comes in, uh, eat and drink. Yeah. That's just kind of included. I was just trying to be cute today, eat, play, love. So when you think about growing your business, think about being more present, being more open to who could be, uh, coming into your sphere, uh, your circle, your surroundings and pay attention to what's in that, in that bubble, so to speak, pay attention to what's being, being presented to you, to what's in front of your face, to opportunities, to people, um, not just to get from them, but to give, to be, and to play together. Um, I'm always looking for more partners, potential partners to play with, uh, for example, in, you know, joint ventures and things like that. But if I'm going to start calling it playing, playing with partners, partner playing, because I think sometimes I know I get too serious about the business stuff. And sometimes I'm like, you gotta fix your website. You gotta do this in your marketing. And I get it. But honestly, I want you to have more fun. I want you to have more fun in your business, your fun getting a client, uh, doing sales conversations, and uh, fun creating your programs, products, pricing, packages, and all that. Have fun networking, following up, speaking, connecting, and playing, right? I believe that when you eat, play, love, you will create more abundance in your life. You will create more freedom in your life. You will get those downloads at the right time. When I'm present and I'm constantly just, and I'm just sitting in without my to-do list, right? When I'm really choosing to be love, the next perfect step comes to my brain and that's it. It's like, oh, this is the path. And I now, now know to trust that inner knowing that gut, that feeling, and I trust that direction and I take action on that, right? So I would just start thinking about how to be more present, be more intuitive, 
feeling your way through next steps, who's the right person for you to work with, uh, what's the right next program to launch, uh, where should I be hanging out, right, on social media, like, you don't have to do it all. I want you to really start getting guidance, that inner guidance, and making those decisions based on fun, pleasure, freedom, and where you are feeling called to go. So I don't know if this makes sense to you today or uh, what you're thinking, but I would love to know if this is helpful, if uh, it's bringing you a new awareness of what's possible for you, or maybe to pattern interrupt what you were on the rampage doing. Um, we got to make this more fun. And I, again, I know sometimes some of the things that I share or promote or, or invite you to <clears throat> might sound like I just want to taskmaster, you know, and make sure you get hard work going. And that's not the case. I actually have a lot of clients who I invite to add date nights to their calendars or um, do take weekends off, of course, for self-care when they weren't going to. So I'm all about the fun and freedom and creating that life that you want sooner than later. And this is Katrina Sawa, jumpstartyourbiznow.com and jumpstartpublishing.net. And I will talk to you soon.